Hi, we're going to graph a parabola, which is nothing new for you. But we're also going to write the equation of the parabola in vertex form. In fact, that's the first question right here. So here's how we do it. Your a number is 2, your b number is negative 2, and your c number is negative 9. To find the vertex, which is what we need, h and k, for this form of the equation, we already have a. a is 2. We need h. Now, if you remember your formulas, h equals negative b over 2a. So it's going to equal negative, negative 2 over 2 times 2, which all comes out to 1 half. So the x-coordinate of the vertex is 1 half. And I plug it in here. And there it is right there. Now to find k, I take 1 half and I substitute it for x. So I'll have 2 times 1 half squared minus 2 times 1 half minus 9. Well, that's negative 19 over 2. That goes in for k. I checked my answer, and this is right. Here is our uh, this equation in vertex form. 2 parentheses x minus 1 half parentheses close squared minus 19 over 2. Now, the vertex is 1 half comma, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, not down there. Hit the right arrow key. Then, comma, then negative 19 divided by 2 right arrow key and right parenthesis. Yay! All right, now we're going to graph. I'm going to make this substantially larger. There we are. Okay. Now, I'm going to graph a parabola, so I click on vertical parabola. Now the first point I have to use is the vertex. That's going to be located at positive 1 half, negative 19 over 2, which as you might recall is negative 9 and a half. Well here's negative 9, here's negative 9 and a half. So over here at 1, ah, that's 1, Here's 1 half. This is 1 right there. This is 1. That's 2. All right, so this is 1 half. And this is negative 9 and a half. So I'm going to click here. No. There. Then any other point on the parabola. Well, let's see. If x is 0, y is negative 9. So I can very easily graph this and save it and check my answer. Woo! Nice work. So here we've put all the pieces together from analyzing quadratic functions. Please feel free to play this again.